Hello everyone, welcome to my Guild Wars 2 series. Um, I'm only going to be recording my character's story playthrough throughout this series, unless of course you guys ask for more Guild Wars 2. You may also be wondering why you can't see my face, as I promised before. Well, the reason is I had an issue with my video camera. For whatever reason, it stops recording after 5-10 to 10 minutes of recording myself. Not sure what the actual cause is, it is an older camera, so my guess is that it's just incompatible with Windows 10. So currently, I'm in the market for a new camera. The channel continues to grow, and it's over 35 subs now. Thank you all for your support, I appreciate it very much. Without you guys, this channel wouldn't be running and even wouldn't be possible at this point. Alright, well enough of me rambling, you came for the video games, let's get on with it and play some video games. Crichton Politics. Centaurs attacked Shaymore today. I did my best to help defend the village. I met up with Captain Thackeray at the garrison, and together we were able to defeat the Centaurs and their summoned Earth Elemental. Now I'm heading to Petra to go to the Merchant's Coin Tavern. Um, do I need to repair any items? We might as well do that before we start a big old mission. Mm, I don't know if she actually did anything, but I'll take it. I didn't read. Ooh, here we go. The beginning of the story. Oh, I was expecting a cutscene. But no. Keep walking. Huh. If you ain't a friend of Big Nose Ted, you ain't welcome here. Come on, sweetness, just one dance. Let's see where it takes us. Only if you get a job, a haircut, and a clue. And maybe not even then. <laughs> Ooh, sick burn. Hey, watch it. You almost spilled Greetings. My drink. I'm so glad to see you. I heard that you were up and around, but I was still worried. I'm fine. Thanks for coming to see me. You know I love you and your father, but you both worry too much. That's because you take too many risks. I'm hey, supposed to be a hero, girl, obviously. Stop gabbing and bring me a drink. <clears throat> I think you've had enough, buddy. You're cut off. Now get out of my tavern. Don't make me cripple you, old man. Give me more ale, and this time, it's on the house. Leave my father alone, you ugly goon, or I'll call the Seraph. Ugly? I'll show you ugly, honey. You're looking for a fight, because now you got one. No nope. Oh man, tavern brawl. Oh my god, what is going on? My guy got all sorts of turned around. Gotta heal up real quick here. Uptown Johnny guy is pretty, pretty tough. Come back here, boy. Run for me. Cut you down. Oh, so he ran away. He's like, I'm almost dead. I'm gonna run. No. All right. Where's Big Nose Ted? I know that big boy's up here. Oh, what are you gonna do about it? You wanna go? Come on. Oh, are you sure it's the wrong choice? There's a shield to the face. That's right. Yeah, that's right. Hold this position. Fucking weakling. This guy. What is his name? Ted. Oh, Ted. You are a big giant pussy. He just keeps sending his goons. Look, he's just standing over there watching. He's like, I can't do anything, so I'm gonna just send everybody else. Okay, okay. I surrender. All right, let's heal up. Good to go. All right, Teddy boy, you ready for let's this? Let's play who can hit the hardest. I'll go first. Oh, here, you want to play this game with me? That's right. I can go hammer it too. Ooh, damn, Teddy boy can hit. 
Yes! Let's do this, Ted. Ooh, it looks like I can hit the hardest, boy. Yeah, switch him back. Oh, big nose, Ted. He's getting wrecked. What about this, Ted? Ooh, that's right. Couldn't hang with the big boys. Yep, this way. Trail of dead goons. Well, I guess not dead. Downed. Bandits, thieves, and brawlers. By order of the Ministry Guard, you are all under arrest. Hey, they started it. I was just defending <clears throat> my friend. Commander Serentine. What's the meaning of this? What are you doing here? Nice of you to show up, Captain. I'm here keeping the peace. Something you and your Seraph can't seem to do. Ooh, power struggle. Thanks to your interference. There's no way I'm letting you take the hero who fought beside me at Shaymor Garrison. I'll vouch for this one. Now who's interfering? And on behalf of a mere commoner? What foolishness. Guards! Take the rest of these maggots to the prison! We're done here. Captain? Please, that ugly goon hurt my father. Can you help us? Hmm. That looks nasty. It could take weeks to heal without the right medicine. And that medicine is expensive. I hate to call in a marker, Captain, but I did help you when you needed it. Mind if I ask you to return the favor? For the hero of Shamor? Done. Talk to Lieutenant Francis at the 9th Company's base camp. Tell him I sent you. And he'll give you all the supplies you need. Sweet. Nice. Mission 1 complete. Well, we'll give you guys a two-parter, because I don't feel like that was a, a full enough mission. How far away is this guy? Oh, he's just... Oh, man. He's way out there. We're going to do the cheating way. <laughs> We're going to teleport. I'm not running that whole way. Hey, look at that. He's right here. Hello, Lieutenant Francis. No, that's not who I want to talk to. Hey, what's up, LT? Search the Bandahonk Caverns. Okay, let's go that way. Oh, I wish I could just ride one of these moas. Like, hey, let me hop on, boy. I need back. Oh, hey, what's up, bandit? I'm gonna say yes. Oh, he's already dead. Overkill. Yes, let's enter the instance. Petra, what are you doing here? How did you my find this exact place? response. I followed you. I'm not going to sit around and worry about my father when I can help. Families look out for each other. You're like family too. I'm not losing either of you. Not without a fight. Fine, you can help. But stay close and be careful. Damn, my yellow gloves look awful. I can take care of myself. You're the one who just got Looks like somebody pissed on my chainmail. <laughs> Switch to the long sword and just wrecked that guy. That's awesome. I do like that ability to switch. You want to just spook him? Okay, let's go. Remember when we used to ride Rancher Meppy's herd? Sounds like something bothering the mower. Everything bothers the last herd. Kick it in the butt. <laughs> Blasted mowers around. Get those stupid birds under control. Kicked King Moa oh, no, in the butt. Oh, not again. I hate catching those stupid birds. I bet they're covered with parasites. Oh, believe me, you won't have too much longer there, bandito. Whoa, look at this. Oh, dang, look at that ability. Okay, I think that was more, uh, more Petra doing some work, but I'll take it. Bam. So much damage. Oh, he tried to run away. He got cut down. Oh, so did she. Go Petra. Hmm. 
So it's probably not this way since it's not really telling me to go this way. I'm gonna guess it's this way. It's, it's probably up above, from the bar. Honestly. Recruits, kill this clown! Oh, uh, sounds like sounds like Ted, the Teddy boy. What up, big boy Ted? I think you're upstairs. All right, let's go find this big boy. We're gonna kill him. I feel like it is him up there. Medical supplies up above, like I thought. Okay. Ooh, hey, two of you. What are you gonna do? Now it's Twitchy Jake. Okay, okay. Surrender. You're, God, these bandits are just—they're little bitches. You guys are so weak. Oh, so then you come and fight after I grab the medical supplies? Oh, come on. Thank you, Jake. Famous for dying, more like it. Good night. Dang, wrecked. I've got to get these supplies back to the Seraph. I'll bring your father what he needs right after I talk to Lieutenant Francis. All right, but hurry. I'll go check on Dad. See you back at the tavern. Sweet. Let's go talk to Lieutenant Francis. What the fuck? Okay, well, I'm not getting tied up in your matters. I don't know what the hell that was. Damn. That guy just... All right. I mean, I guess if I had a big ass fast mount like that too, I'd probably be running. Those look like those sprinklers. Look like the Aladdin lamp. I wonder if there's genies inside. That's so weird. Why do you guys got spinning Aladdin lamps watering your crops? I mean, they look pretty effective. Minus, it looks like you're missing, like, the entire middle of your crop, so it's just creating a big circle. But hey, who am I to judge? I saw a twitchy Jake with the supplies, but the Ministry Guard arrested him. Why is he out? Scoundrel's free again. Hmm, after you take the medicine to your friend, report to Captain Thackeray. He needs to know about Twitchy Jake's early release. I will, thanks. Bandits thanks, fam. Gotta eat somehow. Damn, is it all the way back in there? Where's it at? Particularly oh, we're just gonna teleport there. <laughs> I'm not I'm not running all the way there. That is such a far distance. We were just there. I think it's just in this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ooh, instant. Desperate medicine. Okay. Instant. Instance. Aha! I remember. They're upstairs. Take a left. First door on the right. Quick! Okay. Upstairs. Take a left. First door on the right. Oh, like upstairs, upstairs? Or this one? Oh, this one. Oh. Petra and Andrew just hanging out. Andrew's comfy in the bed. Easy, Andrew. Here, drink this. It probably tastes terrible, but it'll get you back on your feet. Settle down, Dad. I'm here now, and you'll be better soon. Thanks to you, my friend. And please, can you thank Captain Thackeray for us? Of course. Absolutely. I need to speak with him anyway. I've learned something important <clears throat> he needs to know. Captain Thackeray? What are you doing here? We came to check on the tavern keeper. And on you. But where are my manners? Allow me to introduce Countess Anise, Master Exemplar of the Shining Blade. It's an honor, my lady. Captain, I found the medical supplies, but there's something else. Twitchy Jake was there. He's free, even though he was arrested in the tavern brawl. Is that so? There's been no trial. Those troublemakers should still be in prison, unless they've been deliberately freed. But who would do that? And Corrupt why? Corrupt individuals. They'll never tell us willingly. 
I'd send someone to infiltrate their hideout, but they know my surf. I'll go. I don't want Big Nose Ted and his gang on the loose, and I still owe them for hurting my friend. What a brave little soldier you are. Hey, don't You're call me little. Disguise, of course. Hooligans only talk freely to each other. I can tell you where their hideout is. All you need is an outfit from one of the bandits themselves, and you're in. Leave it to me. I'll get the gear I need to blend in and see what they're up to. Outstanding. Pull this off, and you'll be doing Kryta and her queen a great service. And you will have impressed me yet again. Good luck. Alright, well, I think for the time being, it's a good place to stop this episode. Nope, we want to stay in the world. So, I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.